by now. What's up, Monday Geeks, Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in today's video, we are gonna talk about ticket symbol GDRX, Good RX. So this is a company that went public just uh, uh, um, about two months ago, and most recently got caught in a crossfire uh, because Amazon announced that they were gonna start selling uh, medication or prescription to their prime members. So this company kind of took a serious beating because of that. So again, I wanna talk about that in today's video, but before we get started guys if you're new to the channel we talk about how to earn money how to save money how to invest and build wealth so if that's something that interests you go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content so uh, good rx is a company that we talked about here on the channel when they were going public so we did a video about that really capturing what the company does and how it, what kind of opportunity the company was presenting to us as investors so if you didn't watch that video i'm gonna hook it up here so you can definitely go check it out uh, but again, just last week, they got caught in this crossfire where Amazon comes out and announced that they are going to start selling prescription medication to their prime members. And again, at Amazon being a very big company that has strong reputation, people were freaked out. And a lot of investors started running away or shying away from GoodRx. So again, now the question is, is this a time for, for you to buy or, or not? I'm not gonna go into detail again. Like I said, I already have the video that I did about the company here when they went public. But again, this is a company that provides kind of a, a service for people to save money on their prescription medication. So. Amazon steps in and say, we want to start providing medication. People, investors like start selling out and pull the price of the stock. So when I saw that to me, it was a great opportunity because for the most part, if you if you are in this space, you will notice that big companies do things and uh, the small companies that lead in that space always get pounded. Uh, you see investors panic when they come out and make a huge announcement. So I can give you a good example. We can, we should take companies like, um, Zoom, uh, when Zoom last, this just this year, Zoom was like really gapping and going up. And then Facebook came out and said, oh, by the way, we want to start doing our own video uh, uh, conferencing platform. And Zoom took a huge beating. And investors you know, pulled out. Some people were smart, bought in at that low price and made a ton of money. If you look at a company again like Trilo, Trilo back in 2017, when they started, Amazon came out and said, oh, we're gonna start creating the same messaging app, uh, app like Trilo. And Trilo took a, a serious beating. Since then, Trilo has gone up a thousand percent. Look at a company like Roku, when it's through the same thing, when I think Amazon and Apple came out and said, they're gonna be offering the same service as Roku. And Roku took a beating, and now Roku is up 250%. So, Bottom line is uh, a lot of this news for people that don't understand the companies will probably panic, but I see it more as an opportunity to go in at this lower price. So uh, when Amazon actually you know, came out and made the announcement, uh, GoodRx was actually trading at about 50 something dollars and that pulled them down to on their $40. And to me, I was, I'm screaming off the, the, my lungs like, hey, this is buy, 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 because we've seen this particular game happen over and over again with other companies so uh, right now they're still trading at, at under $40 but I think it's a great opportunity so I bought some uh, last week and now I, I'm still gonna looking at adding some more this week so that's a company that I, I see they are leading that space they have relationship with with other pharmacies yes Amazon can come out and say this but uh, again you eventually the long run and you know I'm looking at history here Companies that are leading the space, these big companies will come and say, we want to get in the space. You would see that reaction in the market. But at the end of the day, it goes back to the fact that the leader in that space is uh, good at Rex in, in, this, in this question. So I still like them. Uh, at this price, to me, it's kind of like a discounted price. Again, like when they came out, you know, they're, they're, when they came out, I said, they, that wait for a pullback to buy. So this is that excellent pullback that you can get in. Um, again, don't expect 
to get your returns back maybe in the next week or two. If you're buying now, make sure that you're ready to buy and hold for the next maybe six months to a year or so. Because this is a company, again, like I said, they are just starting out. Once uh, things get back to normal, business goes back at as usual, you're gonna see a lot of people start you know, using their coupons and everything to save money in their prescription. And when people get back to work and they're able to afford their prescriptions, these guys are gonna pick up and just go. So, I mean, as the price Price right now at under forty dollars. Um, my anticipation is that these guys are probably going to see the price target here in the next year or two to over a hundred dollars um, a share. Again, that's that's my my, my speculation here. Um, I don't have a crystal ball that I'm looking at, but I'm just going to service that they provide. So again, they have partnerships with Walgreens, with uh, Walmart, with CVS, with Target, uh, with Safeway. So these are all major players that once you establish this relationship with. It's, it's very, very difficult to just sever ties and go away. And by the way, all these companies are competing against Amazon. So why would they want to uh, just let go GoodRx because Amazon is in the space? They're still going to want to work with GoodRx because they it makes them stronger and makes them be able to go against Amazon. So again, um, if you talk to most pharmacies, they will tell you that, hey, this is a good company. I do have friends that are in that space. Hey, what's up, Kevin? And these are guys there that are, know exactly what's going on. And it's like, hey, this company is a good buy. And so I think, uh, again, at this price point of under $40, it's a good way for you to get in. And you don't have to get it in one big chunk. If you're still worried that the price is probably gonna pull back, the ideal way for you to approach this is buy a little bit and then average your way down or buy a little bit and average your way up. Um, again, for me, I, I'm, I'm in already. I have some shares I'm holding right now and I'm gonna keep adding as uh, money comes in under $40 to me. It's an excellent price point. And I see it just going up from there because the only reason this thing pulled back is because Amazon came out and said uh, that they were gonna start providing uh, prescription medication through uh, their prime service. So that's it for this video, guys. Let me know in the comment section, what do you think about the overreaction reaction for GoodRx or do you currently have GoodRx in your portfolio? If yes, uh, do you look at adding more or are you looking like, hey, this is really bad news. Amazon is maybe a killer. They're going to come after these guys and crush them like a cockroach. Let me know in the comment section. And if you're looking to get started with investing, guys, right now, Weibo is actually doing a promotion where if you sign up and deposit $100, you get four free stocks, not one, not two, not three, four uh, to get you started. Again, I'm going to the links in the description below definitely go check them out and as always guys always make sure that you do your homework do your research ask questions before you invest investing is a dangerous business but if you do it right you can make a lot of money and as always stay safe and stay motivated